respected teachers and my dear, uh, dear students today i would like to tell you uh, one of the most motivational personality of the world who doesn't have legs and arms uh, he was disabled uh, not was he is disabled physically but not uh, mentally spiritually and physically the name of that personality is nick vijay spelling n i c k nick uh, was it v u j i c i c v u j i c i c uh, nick vijay was born to dushka and boris vijay in on 4th december 1982 in melbourne in australia although he was an otherwise healthy baby nick was born without arms and legs he had no legs but two small feet one of which had two toes nick has two siblings michael and aaron initially a victoria state law prevented nick from attending a mainstream school due to his physical disability in spite of lack of mental impairment however vijay became one of the first physical disabled students integrated into a mainstream school once those laws changed however his lack of legs made him a target for school bullies and fell into a severe depression at age of 8 he contemplated suicide contemplated means thought and uh, even tries to drown himself in his bath tub at age when he was 10 he his love for his parents prevented him from following through he didn't uh, commit suicide he didn't allow allow him self in uh, drowned into the bath tub because he had great love and affection for his parents he also seated in his music video something more that god had a plan for his life and he could not bring himself to drown because of this nick prayed very hard that god would give him arms and legs and initially told god that if his prayer remained unanswered nick would not praise him indefinitely however a key turning point in his faith came when his mother showed him a newspaper article about a man dealing with severe disability Jack realized that he wasn't unique in his struggles and began to embrace his lack of legs. After this, Nick realized his accomplishments could inspire others and became uh, grateful to his life. Nick gradually, gradually means slowly figured out, figured out means uh, uh, made solution how to live a full life without limbs. adapting adapting means changing to, uh, according to the situation many of the daily skills that the people accomplish without thinking net uh, he knows how to use a computer and can type up to 45 words per minute using the heel and toe method he has also learned to throw tennis ball play drum pedals get a glass of water comb his hair brush his teeth answer the phone and shave in addition to participating in golf swimming and even skydiving uh, during secondary school he was elected captain of mcgregor state in queensland and worked with the students council on fund raising events for local uh, charities and disabilities campaigns c o m p a i g n s campaigns with movement Uh, when he was 17 he started to give talks at his prayer group and later uh, founded his non profit organizations life without limbs so it is my advice to all teachers and students if possible uh, watch his videos on youtube you will uh, be very much surprised to see that a person who doesn't have legs and arms uh, can do anything Whereas we are blessed with each and every body organ by the grace of the God, but we are zero before Him. So, what is the uh, quote of the today? Uh, today, I would like to tell you one of the most motivational personality of the world. Who doesn't have legs and arms, but he has no legs. Who doesn't have arms and legs, but he has no legs. Who doesn't have arms and legs, but he has no legs. Who doesn't have arms and legs, but he has no legs. Who doesn't have arms and legs, but he has no legs. Who doesn't have arms and legs, but he has no
are like a living example to motivate us how to survive and succeed differently and optimistically. Wish you a great day.